This is our third year now that we're covering Ezekiel Elliott workout clips in the offseason. He dropped some yesterday. We're going to go over those. And they look a lot like the other ones from the last few years. They are fun to watch. They're fun to look at. And we're going to take a look today. But before you do, you need to click that subscribe button because we're looking behind the scenes at these players. Training camp, mini camp, rookie camp, these workouts and everything else. Click that button. Stop missing out. Here's Ezekiel Elliott. We're just going to play it. We're just going to play it. Let me know what you see here. I want to know your reaction if you didn't see the ones from last year. We're going to run through this a few times. It's clipped up. It's cut up. But still. Very similar. Alright. Now let's run through it again. Last year. Around this time. Around April. He started releasing his workout vids. He might have already started releasing some this year. But. They just started coming out left and right. The year prior. Same thing. And there was just a speculation. That first year. Two years ago. 2022. We were like, does he still have it? Does he still have the quickness? And then some clips that kind of looked like it and other clips that didn't. The footwork looks kind of there. And then that next year, 2023, again. And they looked vastly similar to the year prior. I will say this, considering I am the Ezekiel Elliott workout clip guy. And I do have the data in my head from looking at all these in the videos. They're all on the channel. I would say he looks a little thinner. Looks a little trimmer. He's got a little pop in the step. I will also say that these do not look drastically much better than the years prior. And the years prior, we know what happened last year. We know what happened the year before. NFL running back wise is very dependable. He's going to get it done between the tackles. He's going to run the play. He's going to protect the football. He's going to help out your NFL team. He deserves to be on an NFL roster at the right cost. Because of that, he can help an NFL team. But if you're looking for fantasy, might want to stay away unless he's free. And I say free more like a money ball play from week to week. And you're not looking at him now, maybe in season. But more as a money ball play, but you can say that with damn near any running back that is breathing on the field. That being said, Ezekiel Elliott, functionality-wise, last year he can help a team due to his dependability. Upside-wise, it's not really there. But he can keep the locomotive going on your offense if you need him. I mean, he's like one of the best backs in the league still at pass protection. And all the little things. It's just the feet, the speed, the explosiveness isn't there anymore. He's not going to be a guy grinding it 20, 25 times. He's just not going to be doing that for you. But in a pinch or as a guy in your rotation, he's a guy to look at. But we're going to be looking at his workout videos all off season long. We're going to be looking at that because he's going to be posting it. He's going to be trying to get on a team. He's going to be trying to get latch on to an NFL team and be on the depth chart. It'll probably be late in camp, early in the NFL season, but Ezekiel Elliott will probably be back once some injuries hit. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Make sure to hit that subscribe button on the way out. I want to thank you for watching. Catch you on the next video.